So guess what? I have finally made it to the UK and it's freezing and I love it. I have finished all of my auditions. Um, I actually got through to the second round for one of them which I really was not expecting so I'm really happy. Um, my experience so far has been really positive. Um, there were a lot of schools that seemed quite keen so I'm really really happy. I just hope I can find the funding. <laughs> um, so yeah I'm um, looking back on my last video I'm really glad that I made that tough decision and decided right I need to just focus on this because I feel that my voice has improved heaps since I since I made that last video it's in a much better place now I've got much healthier technique going on and um, I didn't even realize at the time just how like how hoarse I was in that video so COVID really had taken its toll so I'm glad that I let myself recover from that I absolutely made the right decision um, as sad as I was not to be part of that show but um, yeah I'm so stoked to be here and to have finished my auditions um, yeah for someone like me who is on the spectrum it was you know very overwhelming traveling um, I was really lucky though that I went with my mum um, she took a lot took on a lot of the um, the travel admin which uh, took weight off my shoulders because I had to do all the um, the other admin um, to do with lessons and auditions and all that jazz so yeah and I would like to thank all of you who have helped make this possible everyone who donated to my give a little everyone who just provided moral support who gave me singing lessons who um, yeah provided opportunities for me to fundraise and develop my craft you guys are the best um, so yeah here I am in the snow it's so awesome it's so uh, yeah let's explore the snow this snow is like nothing I've ever seen before even when it snowed in Stratford um, it was nowhere near it was really thick but it was nowhere near this powdery and dry like my gloves were still dry after making a snowball see how powdery that is Ugh, that went in my face oops <laughs> Um, and so yeah, it's, it's just like the storybooks to me, it's crazy, it doesn't look real, it does not look real. And you see those footprints? Those are fox footprints, there are foxes that jump over that hedge and uh, one of them pooped somewhere in this vicinity. I think I stood in it, whoops. Um, and this is a... A fish pond or frog pond rather so I hope there's no frogs in there because it's frozen it is the thickest pond ice I've ever seen and I built a tiny snow dude he's very cute I'm not very good at building snowmen yet um, I'm used to building sand castles so he kind of looks like a sand castle I'll take you on a tour of this snowy garden Look at those trees, ah, and trampoline. I think I'm probably a bit big now to jump on that particular snow-covered trampoline, but um, I do have a video of me jumping on my own snow-covered trampoline back in the day, if you would like to click the link in the doobly-doo. Wow. The sound is like something I've never heard before. Well, I have, but not often. Look at all that. The winter wonderland. So yeah, I am super stoked to be here. Um, so if you've got 
a dream or a goal, like my big dream slash goal, and it seems a bit out of reach, um, just keep going, keep taking those tiny steps because I've been really surprised how far I've come and I reckon so will you. And if you have to do some things unconventionally or differently or later than most people, that's okay too. You can still do it. I love you. Bye.